2023 was was a good one. Set some goals that are like, they may sound crazy to you right now, but set some that are gonna be fucking hard to actually do. You may not believe it right now in your mind that you can do it, but trust me, you can you can fucking do that. Obviously, we joined Second Gear Supplements this year. Looking forward to see where that goes. Waking up at 3.15 a.m. every day during my bodybuilding prep. New news. Hey, buddy. morning everybody first workout after Christmas big chest day today finally I got some of my apparel from second gear supplements so I'm wearing my Mary Trenmas shirt super comfy oversized shirt it's hilarious so whenever the sweatshirt comes off you'll see that chest and back day hopefully feel good not sure how I feel right now honestly I had to talk myself out of going back to sleep I don't know why I'm kind of struggling lately with that extra motivation Usually I can get up no problem at 3, 3.15 in the morning, get up, get my shit going, but I don't know, I've been struggling a little this week, so hopefully we have a good workout. I love a calm, cool gym in the morning, super important to me, but we'll see what we got. Let's get a good chest day in, see you guys in the gym.
weight. Felt kind of weak again, but could have pushed a little, little more weight. But overall, I'm happy with it. Merry Trunmas. Check out Second Gear Apparel. The oversized shirts are my favorite. These are super thick material, good for winter time. They got a whole bunch of different apparel there. They got hats, everything else. Thank you guys for coming along. I needed you for that workout. Get a good start to your new year. We got a lot to do this year. A lot of business to take care of, so let's get her started strong. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for joining me on this fitness journey, and we will see you later. Have a good day. This is some of that chickpea protein pasta, two chicken thighs, made, uh, mixed it with some feta and tomatoes, a little olive oil, super good. Not officially yet, but it is basically the end of 2023. Currently December 31st. Ended our year with a great arm pump. Getting a, a nicer dinner tonight with a Rachel. As a person, I feel like I've grown like, I grew a lot this year, I feel like. I still feel like I have a lot of growing to do as a person, but overall, I am pretty happy with how this year went. Wasn't perfect, but I tried. Obviously, it wasn't until this year that we uh, started documenting our fitness journey filming stuff to look back on, filming experiences, like me and Rachel have filmed a lot this year. Obviously, I've gotten into filming my workouts, which I've really enjoyed. No, it's been a lot of work editing videos and stuff, but it's actually something I have come to really enjoy. This video marks 31 weeks in a row filming and posting every single week, which uh, is one of my favorite parts of 2023 that I've started to do. And I continue, plan on continuing it through the through the next year. I feel like posting on Instagram and on YouTube and being transparent has helped me a lot. I mean, when I first started recording vlogs and shit, like I was super awkward on camera and stuff. Now I feel like I can just turn it on and talk to it, just like I'm talking to another person. And you know, I feel like that's helped me a lot as a person. And I hope, I hope it's helped other people with their mental struggles with their physical struggles however posting on like instagram even has made me a lot more comfortable in my skin like do i love the way i look completely no but i'm coming to terms with you know i like the person i'm becoming i don't hate how i look the gym has definitely helped me a lot i've taken the gym to a whole new level this year i went through my bodybuilding prep i and all those struggles, I mean, that was a big growing period for me too. I got down to single digit body fat. I, I was running 20, 25 miles a week, which isn't a lot, but for me it was a big step in the right direction. But so I, maybe next week we'll make a video and talk about our goals for fitness goals, life goals for the next year. I feel like I just wanted to stick to this year in this video, even though this video is coming out in the new year, I wanted to focus on what happened in 2023 because I don't know I feel like 2023 was a very pivotal year in my existence I have actually struggled a lot this year mentally I had a lot of mental struggles this year a lot of growing I needed to do a lot of growing I need to do still honestly if I didn't have the gym I don't know I'd be probably in a really dark place this year but we have a lot to go to do in 2024 we'll talk about that in the next video but 2023 was was a good one i started going waking up at 3 15 a.m every day during my bodybuilding prep monday through friday every day 3 15 a.m quickly get ready get to the gym get cardio and a workout in 
Once my prep ended, that turned into Monday, Wednesday, Friday. 3.15 a.m., get your fucking ass up. No other choice. Not gonna, not gonna put this off. Staying disciplined. Getting up and getting that shit done with. I feel like that translates into other parts of your life. I appreciate everybody that's clicked on my videos, clicked on my profile. I mean, I'm doing it. My goal is I really wanna help other people too. A lot of people, a lot of you that watch my videos probably don't know, at one point I was like, I mean, not severely overweight, but I was pretty large. We lost a ton of weight. We started going to the gym. I don't know, I've been working out consistently for three years maybe, 2024, over three years actually. Over three years we've been doing this for, and it's been fun. We've definitely learned a lot about like fitness this year too. I feel like I've become pretty knowledgeable. I feel like I still have a shit ton to learn, but definitely am a lot more knowledgeable than I once was too, so. I don't know, this year was the year of growing, I tell you. A much needed year of growing, and 2024 there's gonna be a lot of changes coming. Just wanted to end the video. I wish every one of you the best in 2024. If you're watching me, I'm rooting for you. In 2024, I honestly, honest to God, I hope you all thrive. I hope you push yourself to reach some new goals. Set some goals that are like, they may sound crazy to you right now, but set some crazy goals. Have a balance of some that are, you can obtain pretty easily, but set some that are gonna be fucking hard to actually do. You may not believe it right now in your mind that you can do it, but trust me, you can you can fucking do them. I don't have the confidence always either, but I feel like I've done some pretty, pretty crazy shit this year that I would have never believed was remotely possible. There's no reason it can't be you. Do whatever you gotta do to make it happen. Make sacrifices, make changes. You can't live the same way you're living right now and expect to have expect to be different expect to be better you gotta change things thank you thank you 2023 for real this was a year of growth for me a big year of growth i didn't expect it but i needed it thank you guys again for following my journey i love everybody that's been a part of it obviously we joined second gear supplements this year I'm looking forward to see where that goes a lot of cool stuff is going to be happening next year so Stay tuned, keep coming in every Thursday to the channel. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok. I post a lot on both of those, Instagram especially. Instagram is Bailey Addis Fit. TikTok, Bailey.Addis. Subscribe, like, comment, and I guess I'll see you guys next year. This is it. We will see you in 2024.